So, a lot of people have been telling me lately that I'm just too extreme with my vegan beliefs and that I'm just prattling on like a crazy religious fanatic, telling people not to eat meat and killing animals is wrong, when in reality the only problem is just with how we raise animals and how we slaughter them. If we just only consumed grass-fed, organic, free-range meat that was killed using humane, cruelty-free slaughter practices, then it's perfectly fine. And, you know, I've actually relaxed my stance on this and I've become more moderate. I think it's perfectly fine to commit murder as long as your victim died quickly, painlessly, and had a great life before you killed them. And it's actually a lot easier to humanely kill humans since pretty much every human being is free range. You don't see too many people locked up in cages like these animals we eat. You know, people can do pretty much whatever they want, whenever they want. They can go for a walk in the park or go see a movie. So it's really easy for me to pick out human victims. And I actually like to just go that extra mile and make sure I'm doing things especially ethically and humanely. I like to pick out people who have, you know, great lives, who just love living and would hate to die. People with big loving families, maybe a wife, husband, kids who would be absolutely devastated if they died, and if they have a job that they love and a great growing career, and just, you know, so much great things to look forward to and a great life ahead of them, then I single out those people, wait for a perfect opportunity when they're all alone, and I just walk up behind them and just bash them over the head with a steel baton. They didn't even know it's coming. They're out cold instantly, so it's perfectly humane. And just to make sure, I just bash their head in with my baton a few more times just to make sure they don't wake up and that they're not experiencing any pain because, you know, I just gave them severe brain damage. Then I just drag them off to a safe location, hang them upside down, cut open their throat, and just make sure they're blood spills into a big jar and then I cut them up into little pieces and keep them in my freezer and I think it's actually more humane to go after children because there's just so much for them to look forward to you know there's so many great opportunities that you can just take away from them and especially like teenagers who are first starting to date and uh, experiencing love for the first time in their lives it's just so humane to kill them at such a great high point in their life. So, yeah, I think um, humane, cruelty-free slaughter is great. Uh, I support it, and I hope all of you live, you know, great, fulfilling lives because, you know, someone like me just might come around and take it away from you.